Hey, what's going on everybody? I've got a um, video for you guys here. I'm testing out. I've got this Wotion um, KG935H um, ham radio. And I'm testing out the antennas that came with it. And so I've got this dual band antenna here. And then it also came with the uh, 220. Um, let's put it here so you can see. A 220 designated antenna. We're going to test the SWR on that. And then, of course, this uh, this dual band. Oops, messed with my camera here. I don't want to screw anything up here. It took me a while to set all this up. So I've got a uh, Wotion dual band antenna hooked up right now and let's do a test on the 70 centimeter and I'm just gonna hold it up like this it's on high power 1.84 SWR okay okay so we're gonna type in All right, I'm going to do this one. I don't like doing the call channel just in case people want to use it. So this is okay. So this is a dual band. So it's 1.8 on uh, UHF. 1.28. That's pretty good. Uh, it's acceptable on two meters so yeah cool so yeah that it's a little high on I mean it's 1.8 and I've got all kinds of contraptions hooked up here so on UHF it's fine but you know the the um, the two meters read really well and so I'm gonna hook up this 70 centimeter antenna now and that's what we got there. And I'm just running this through coax out the back of the SWR meter here. You know, it may not be the most accurate, but it's coming out pretty good compared to my um, other testing um, of these antennas with different methods. So we're just going to try this. So we're on, uh, oh, we got to get to 220. So. Uh, let's see here. How many channels do they got programmed in here? Yeah, quite a bit. All right, we're going to go to 220. And we are at 1.03. And it does 1 to 1. That's perfect. Nice. The 220 antenna is excellent. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. I totally dig that. So that's your reading right there. So I mean it's it's pretty accurate. So I have another antenna that I just for for kicks here. I've got the uh the Goya NA320A. This is a tri-band antenna. This is that beast antenna. This thing's huge. Let's hook this up and we'll go through all three bands on this antenna and see what the Nagoya does. So let's start out on 220 since we're there and um, see what we got. 1.4 on 220. That's pretty good for a tri-band antenna. Okay, we're going to turn down to 70 centimeters. All right, here we go. Not quite as good there. 2.77. Okay, not quite as good. Let me uh, clear my call here. Okay, we're going to go down to 2 meters. Oops, I'm going to type in... Um, 
Yeah, we'll do that. All right, here we go. 1.65-ish. That's not bad. All right. Okay, so the Nagoya 328 was pretty good on all three. Not, not excellent on all three. I have one more that I want to try. This is one of my favorite antennas I like using. It's the Nagoya uh, NA24J. It's very, very, let me, let me show you guys real quick. This one. Yeah, it's a good antenna. Um, we'll see what, we'll see what we get out of here. All right, we're just going to stick with the 1465000. This is just a dual band VHF UHF antenna. Um, Nagoya 24J. All right. 1.93. Not that great. 1.9. Okay. All right, we're going to uh, go to 440 here. Okay, we're going to switch over to 440. And there we go. 1.5 that's acceptable I really am happy with 1.5 or less on antennas that's pretty good okay okay guys so there's a little bit of a test for you take it for what it's worth um, I just decided to goof around and hook up some coax and throw some antennas on the SWR meter uh, I can't say it's really scientific or whatever but it's equal to whatever I'm doing all the other antennas I'm testing I'm doing it the same way and you got to see some power uh, output settings there too the reflective power and all that stuff so um, there you have it just wanted to throw that out there let me know what you guys think is this uh, a really crappy way I don't have a nano VNA um, it'd be nice to do that um, don't have one of those. I have a tiny, uh, a uh, tiny SA um, spectrum analyzer, but I do not have the the nano VNA yet. But um, maybe someday. Uh, gosh, spend so much money on this stuff anyhow. <laughs> so yeah, hope you guys like it. The KG nine three five H. The if you're gonna use this radio on two twenty as good output good wattage output on 220 i'm this is going to be my 220 rig um and the antenna is one to one match you don't see that very often so all right you guys thanks for watching have a good one let me know what you think is this a bunch of baloney or you uh you appreciate it and please like and subscribe have a good one catch you later